this video is going to show you how you can back up your Firefox bookmarks to a USB stick. This is handy if you just want to make sure that you've got a backup copy of them or if you want to transfer them to a new PC or laptop. If you're watching this video as a short, tap on the thumbnail in the bottom right hand corner right now to see the full video. If you're already watching the full video, hold tight, more details coming up shortly. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things help us make more great videos for you. OK, so first things first, plug your USB pen drive or external hard drive into your computer. Now, I must say the drive can be of any size because the file that you're backing up is absolutely tiny. So you don't need to have a lot of room and it doesn't have to be a drive that you need to wipe clean because it will just sit quite happily alongside anything else that's on it. Although I would say don't use a recovery drive for this. Use a drive that you're using for photos, videos or general documents or backups. So I'm going to plug my drive into the USB socket on my laptop. Keep an eye on the bottom right hand corner of the screen. Make a note of what comes up. Mine says USB drive D. OK, so you'll need to make sure that uh, you make a note of that, that. Then you want to go into the three horizontal lines just at the top there and then go into bookmarks and then go into manage bookmarks just at the bottom there. And up the top, you've got import and backup. Left click once on that and then left click once on backup. And when it asks you where do you want to back up to, then what you want to do is you want to go down and you want to look for whatever came up when you plugged your pen drive or your hard drive in. On mine, it came up USB drive D. So I left click once on that and left click save. And then let's just go out of this. So click on the crosses, go into any yellow folder, click on this PC and then click on my USB drive D. And hopefully we should have a file that says bookmarks and today's date backwards. Each time you create a backup, it will add the date to the end of it backwards. So it's the 6th of August 2023 as I'm recording this. So there you go. It's come up 2023 08, which is the month for August and 06, which is the date. Now, as you obviously back up more and more, you can just manually delete the older ones as and when you don't need them. So you could make a rule of keeping the last three or four backups and delete anything older. To do that, just right click on it. And then if you're running Windows 11, click on the bin. Or if you're running Windows 10 or below, click on delete. But obviously make sure that you've got a few first. So let's just test it out. So I'm going to go back into Firefox and I'm going to delete a couple of bookmarks. So just by accident, let's delete Facebook, Reddit and eBay. Oh. I've deleted them accidentally. Now I want to restore them. Plug in the external hard drive or pen drive. So let's just do that. Wait for it to appear at the bottom right hand corner of the screen just to confirm that it's connected. And then we want to click on the three horizontal lines just up there on the top. Then go down to bookmarks, click on bookmarks and then go down to manage bookmarks and click manage bookmarks. And then we need to go to import and back up there and then we want to go to restore. So I'm going to go down to choose file and I'm going to go down here on the left to USB drive D where I backed them up to select the file with the latest date on it, double left click and it comes up with a warning. This will replace all of your current bookmarks with the backup. Are you sure? Yep. So I'm going to click on OK and then click on the cross just up there. And there you go. As you can see, the bookmarks I accidentally deleted earlier, Reddit, Facebook and eBay have now returned. So there you go. I hope you like this guide. And if you did, why not help support this channel? Have a look in the description down below. If you're in the market for a VPN, a Fire Stick or Fire Stick accessories, we've got them in the description down below. Subscribing to these services or buying these products really does help us support this channel. It helps me to dedicate more time to bringing great videos to you. Also, whilst you're here, why not stick around? Have a look through my YouTube channel. I've got thousands of other videos right here, right now, covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully, whilst you're here, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you, and maybe 
even save you some time and money. And don't forget, if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button and hit that like button.